Hi, I'm David John with General Produce Company here in Sacramento, California. And today we have some bananas that we're going to talk about. Not the traditional bananas that you buy every day as far as what we call the Cavendish varieties, or even the Reds and Ninos that we talked about. But we have a few different ones. We have one that's called the Burro. Now this is real popular in the Philippines and in Mexico and becoming more and more popular here in the States. It's actually not quite as sweet. It's a little milder flavor, very creamy. You'll see when it ripens, it'll even get black spots, very dark, creamy yellow color. And this is normal. Don't let the spots bother you. You think it's rotten at all. It's very normal for it to come up. But with a milder flavor, it blends very well in fruit salads, when you're baking muffins. It doesn't dominate the flavoring of the rest of the products you put in your muffin. It just gives a nice, smooth banana flavor to it and it's enjoyable just as a banana. Peel it and eat it like any of them. The other one that you probably see out there a lot that you just walk by and say, what is this big ugly banana? Well, it's called the plantain and it's actually made for cooking. It's a real low moisture content, so it's a heavy starch, it creates very little sugar to it. What sugar is gonna be in it, you add. But you can cook it just almost like a potato. You peel it, Best thing when you get it peeled and the banana out is rinse it in the water a little bit. Wash some of the starch away. You can mash it like a potato and make a little pan fry out of it, a little fritter. You can deep fry it in a batter for a fritter. Or the real neat trick out there is cut it in about half inch slices. Put it on a cookie sheet, a little bit of oil, and bake it for uh, maybe a half an hour, 40 minutes. When it comes out, a little sea salt on top of it and lime juice. Great treat for the kids in the afternoon totally healthy and trust me they'll love it you'll be making them once a week for them but this green state and this big ugly thing is a beautiful treat if it happens to get a little ripe onto you save it for the barbecue even if it turns black there's nothing wrong with that put it in a little foil cut it in half and and foil it up when it comes out drizzle a little bit of honey or something on it and it's a great dessert after your barbecue you've had to relax with and that's the produce beat.